about school closures, and that's why we talked about the loss of affordable housing. Because it's not necessarily a bad thing to have a metro stop. The question is for who? Yeah. It's not a bad thing to have a river walk. The question is for who? We are being forced out over Shore area, over Howard University area. At the end of next year, we are told that we're supposed to move. Off the paper, Hurlsburg, mixed income, ain't working. I live over there. Yeah. It's working. not working. The schools, the children are being bused to school. The ones that's coming back over there, they're being bused to school because Van Ness Elementary School is gone. The civil rights lost in the payoff. The what's affordable today is deplorable. And Chocolate City cost of living is horrible. They got it now, so you got to make a mint to keep your head above. I think the main cause of displacement is people coming to our city saying it's a really nice place if we can move these poor black people out. Greed and a, a lack wow. of value for those who uh, don't have a lot of money. Lack of political organization, community, um, so solidarity. Unbridled capitalism and corporate greed. Extreme inequalities. I don't want to presume what's the most important, but the one I think we need to work on uh, is the uh, closure of schools and the firing of teachers. What undermines housing is what happens to schools. Schools should not be closed. Never mind the fact your neighborhood school was bulldozed flat. Michelle redid that. Ask the parents up in Bruce Monroe off Georgia Ave. They will let you know. We're being relocated and children are losing out. We don't have as many schools and we don't have housing. These charter schools are publicly funded, and any special interest group can basically run it. Brothers and sisters, the problem is special interest. Discrimination needs a wiggle room of only inches. Let me relate to you with open my eyes. By profession, I am a real estate agent, but I'm also an advocate. And whenever I go into meetings, especially when it surrounds huge housing complexes, and I hear, oh, you're going to get to come back. It's a one one for one development. I tell them every time, you are being lied to. Trust me. Yes. Trust me. Yes. I'm a real estate agent, but I don't want to see you displaced. Yes. It happens. And I'm glad that the entire BC has got us together so that we can talk about it. Yeah. yeah. It seems that it's fairly obvious what's going on, right? Mm -hmm. uh -huh. And this has happened in the city before, will continue to happen unless we continue to fight. I'm not saying we're not fighting, we need to continue to fight, right? If you want to change your situation, you better join an organization. If you want to change your situation, you better join an organization. If you want to change your situation, you better join an organization. If you want to change your situation, you better join an organization. Check it. Hey, the story of America is labor. If you don't know the truth, lies will enslave you. Beware of aristocratic behavior.